What's up guys, Jay here and um, welcome to this pretty random stream where I'll be playing a bit of Baldur's Gate 3 on my own. I am normally. But yeah, um, I've already gone through a bit of the story now. If anything, this is more of a taster session to see how the community likes the idea of this. <laughs> Pardon me. See again, we've um, reached the goblin camp. No, not the goblin camp. Um... Oh, I don't remember. Right. We should have stayed in Here's my character. All right. Didn't realize I had those gloves. Good. Map. Uh, that's not what I put on with. That was. Right. Forgive that display. Aradin's a blowhard, but that's no cause for me to join him. Thank you for your help out there. I'm Zevlor. Well met. I should warn you. Visitors are no longer welcome in this grove. Okay. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. I thought druids were peaceful. Goblin got you. The druid Halsin's a renowned healer, but he didn't make it back from Aradin's expedition. If it's not too serious, you could try his apprentice, Nettie. She's with the other druids in the inner grove. They've started a ritual to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You, though... I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare, if nothing else. Hmm. Yeah, let's see what not. Hang on, let me try the ring. Hmm. I'm not sure what to think about the Sea of Thieves overlay with this. I think you should. Yes. No harm in trying the diplomatic route. We owe you a great there you go. debt. Let that work. If we're forced to leave now, we won't make it to the city. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense. If more lives are lost. I guess I better see what this uh, druid's all about then. Yeah, I'm. To be frankly, I am a paladin. Let's talk to this guy. Refugees, adventurers, no one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met. And thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Yay. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. I know it's drastic, but more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. We druids will be safe. As for those that took refuge here, well, may Sylvanus guard them as they continue their travels. Something seems wrong about this. You sound just like Korga. <laughs> but it had to come to this. I pray to Sylvanus each night. The Wildfather will protect those refugees. I hope. Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. I wouldn't expect much of this to be useful at the moment. This looks useful though. I 
and I bought it with my own money. I think that's all I can get for the moment. There we go. Sylvanas guide your Please. I won't leave them behind. You're going to get us killed. Interesting. I think I'll keep all of that axe for a bit. Pels, we mm. can't just leave. They're kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blazing spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. I made no such oath yeah, and like I will rules. not be held responsible for these people. Just be responsible for yourself then. We have to stay. It's the right thing to do. Sir. Fine. We'll stay. If we survive, it'll make for a good story, I suppose. Thank you, Roland. Yay. Now, where's Will? Go on. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. Whoopsie. Oh. <laughs> Fuck off, you twerp. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Kind words in unkind times, my friend. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... Sh the man's smile bends downward, and his thoughts become yours. You are the Blade of Frontiers, racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You were on the ship. Yes. Better friends than the ones hitching a ride in our skulls, at least. I'm sure you know the stories. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid. They say there's no coming back. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so. Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. You sure? I'm no stranger to the Infernal. Better to slay a devil before her fires burn common folk to ash. Her name is Karlak, an archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Um. Mm. Just so you know, my first duty is Karlak. I'm oath bound to go after her. But I won't deny this infection is bothersome. I accept your invitation. Sorry, but there's no room for me.
Lazel, off of you. Until later, then. Ready and willing. Hmm. The famous Blade of Frontiers in the flesh. Clever, this hero act you've got going. Hero, Blade. Name strangers gave me. My friends call me Will. Excellent. If we ever become friends, I'll know what to call you. Oof. Time I needed. Until Karlak shows up, I think these will be the main three I use. I didn't know Karlak was... I didn't know Will was a warlock. Yep, if this guy's got Eldritch Blast, then yeah, I know what to do here. He doesn't have Eldritch Blast. Hey, hey, Kira. So, a bit of a context, um... I've actually started a single run. Like um, I kind of did it with uh, Meg watching my back the other day. And hey, I might as well do it here. You could give me a hand actually with something. Uh, where's Eldritch Blast? There's Clouded Dag. Actually, with this, I think whole person might help. Pack to the blade, I think, will help because, as you can see, Will has a weapon. Oh, Why is Eldritch Blast? Unless he's already got it. Yeah, there it is. Alright. Okie dokie. So, you two had a right time then. Never a dull moment. Hmm. Yeah, let me, let me show you what the character's about. I made, I made them her a paladin. I wonder if I can expose Anti Ethel in the in the camp. Hello. You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the point. Get out of the way. She didn't oh, kill your brother, Arca. You're better than this. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to begin with. Oof. I didn't ask for you to say a damn thing! Keep out of it! Calm down. Gail approves. <laughs> I don't even know who Looks I want like to fuck you. Absolute here. sent me a protector. You gonna kill her too? You move! Ooh, who sh what should I, um... I need to roll a 10, alright. Alright, alright, we're good. You're right. I wish you weren't, I really do. Damn you. Damn it! Why do you care if a goblin lives or dies? Hmm. 
You'd better be right. I am right. I'm dragging. It's alright, Arca. Yay! Let's go. People approve. I did it, I did it. <laughs> Ooh, someone wants to talk to me. Believe it or not, but I witnessed a similar standoff back at the yawning portal. Of course, an establishment like that invites all sorts of outlandish entertainments. Oh, a drow, a dragonborn, and a cleric of Cyric walk into a bar. Your standard fare. It sounds like the sound of a bad joke. Maybe someone was cheating at cards. Maybe it was some weird lover's quarrel. In any case, out came the crossbow, and a hush fell over the entire room. I stood up and yelled, Shadow Dark Ale for everyone. The crowd cheered. The tension drained into five dozen tankards, and soon all was well again. Ah, uh, yes, alcohol solves like many things. The most powerful Just magic like is speed and for power. a round of drinks. Mind you, all I did was call for ale, but you went and stood in front of that crossbow. Ah, oh, drink to that. <laughs> oh, this is fun. Is it a good idea for me to get in there? Where's Elito? It doesn't look like Elito too much. Neither does that. I'm gonna buy the heads off your kids and your birdies and your dogs. Well, there's nothing in there. Yeah, I wonder if I can expose Auntie Ethel here. It isn't the talk of the camp. It's a rare day when I see one of you lot about. Thank goodness you came along when you... Oh! There isn't a bit of colour in those cheeks, Petal. Are you hurt? Cold? Feverish? Auntie Ethel will search out. I've lotions and potions galore. Oh, nothing as fancy as that. But I come from a long line of women with a dab hand at such things. Aha! Uh -huh. You take a sip of that and you'll feel right as rain, sweetie. Well, that depends. What's wrong, lovey? I've seen it all. I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. The wife was none too pleased and introduced him to a pot of boiling oil. But worry not. I fixed him up, and depending on the lighting, he looks good as new. My point is, whatever ails you, I promise I've seen worse. Is it actually a way to what expose Auntie Ethel? What's wrong? As you recount your adventure, Auntie Ethel... Oh, Shadowheart disapproves. ...her eyes wide. You poor pet! I, I've i never a potion or lotion here that could do it, but... Yes, I may have something at home. I'm sorry, but I can't do much for you here. You could try asking. Most folk won't be as understanding of... I'll be heading home soon. Here, let me mark it on your map. Just in case. Now, do you need anything? I have a few odds and ends for sake. Hey, bother. Give me all the money. <laughs> I didn't know Auntie Ethel sold of stuff. B 
Be careful on the... Depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? Hmm. <laughs> True. How long do you think we've got before the goblins come? Um... We should be getting drunk, at least. No fun waiting for death sober. Okay, apparently I need to do something with him, but I don't know what. Thanks for fighting off those goblins. If you need to replace any gear, just ask. My selection is pretty slim. I had to leave most of my equipment in Eltera. Ooh, goody. I don't have the money, though, do I? <laughs> let's, sell, let's sell some stuff. Hmm. I won't need the club. How about that big mace? Maybe? But I don't really need that right now. I need like some clothing that works. Hmm. Maybe the shield? Uh, yeah, that'll work. There we go. Druids, this grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. Again, okay, it's time to talk to this, this guy. Is ridiculous. But... We should be getting drunk at least. I guess we'll go downstairs. Do I have that speak to animals thing? I've got to speak with the dead. It wouldn't be a good idea to do that, would it? What do you want, sell, mate? Whoa! Hey! Can't say I've ever seen... Oh, on. hang on. Take this ring. It's lucky. You haven't seen anything yet, lady. Go on, take the ring and watch your fortune change. You kept me with all that, I still lost it. Whoops. <laughs> Hard luck, lady. But like I said, we can change that. Watch. Call it. Heads or tails. Heads it is. See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheap, too. Interested? You got it. One sec. That's what I got. He doesn't have much, does he? Nothing cool. You suddenly feel something moving against your back and turn. I can't do this anymore, Batis. I'm sorry. 
you got some explaining to do, Hornhead. Uh, hey, are you here to trade or? Yeah, I know. I was standing right here telling her to rob you. Want all you want. She's somewhere safe and staying that way. Look, you caught her. Good for you. You want a chump like everyone else around her. Now, do me a favor. Make room for the chumps. Yeah, will take any. Will's well, got a lot to say, hasn't he? <laughs> Another will, uh, Gale. Isn't it? All this traveling and adventuring. Why don't we take a little break? Hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest? <clears throat> Gives me a chance to talk to you about something. Well, rather important. What is it? We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't we? Hmm? Survived some perils, <laughs> overcame some obstacles. Ever since you were kind enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate remarkable guile and courage. The way you diffused the tension between Zevlor and Aradin. The way you stood in front of a crossbow to prevent a murder. In short, I've grown to trust you. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul, except for my cat. Uh, you see, I have this All right, the parasite condition. thing. Very different from the parasite we yeah, share. Yeah, the, the whole eating off thing. Just as deadly. The specifics are rather personal, but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with, though not without some effort. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. Uh... I can say no more on the matter. Not now, anyway. Just trust me when I say it's all of vital importance. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact, and before we were abducted. It's only a matter of time before my craving returns. Do you want to sl that slurpy is why strong? I turn to you. I need you to help me find magic items to consume. It is vital. Dare I say it? Critical. Is this dealt through cutscenes, or do I have to actually force feed him out of axe? We've already done the finding. In fact, you have one in your possession. Do I? You know for yourself how hard one such an item was, and it will be no easier when even more are required to assuage my hunger. There'll be danger involved, or great cost. Splendid. Bit of boldness will serve us well. I'm sure we won't have to look very far to find what I need. Faerun overflows with magic-infused treasure. As do our packs, as a matter of fact. We have such an item already in our possession. Primed for the moment the need arises. I hope I can count on you. Mm. Where's that kid that robbed me? Chance I'll fit in there. Do we have anything that can go down there? You have my attention. Ah! Where's the camera going? Where's the hole? Can't give up now. Kara, why isn't this working? Or do I need a druid for this? Have 
have a lot on my mind. And Not a chance I'll fit in there. I don't know. Please, let us through. Let my daughter go right now! She's a thief, Hellspawn. And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, Ugh, let me through, Ragrashem, or I'll rip your damn throat out! <gasps> Bear. Mm. I'll try something, mate. Carl Magrin, give her a chance. You get back. Keep back. Force my hand, and I'll show you its claws. A moment, I Giona. What? Oh, I understand. You. Apparently, Corga wants to see you. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It feels weird seeing druids are being like hostile, since in other continuities, druids are known to be peaceful. Uh, save the girl. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. She's a parasite. Shut it. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. I swear if this doesn't work. I was lucky. Very well. I'll defer to your ruling. My circle has offered grace to these outsiders. We gave them shelter from storms. We nourished their bellies. In return, these devils lured in a horde of goblins. And their spawn stole the one relic that might keep us safe. We've taken back our relic. But I will keep the fiend caged till our protection right is complete. Whoa, whoa. What's going on with my land cable? I... I was scared. They said when the rite was over, we'd have to leave. But there's goblins out there and worse. And it's nice here. So I... I took the idol. I thought maybe then we could stay. Please let me go. I'll be good, I swear. Well, Paladin, what say you? Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Tila, to me. Out, thief. My grace has its limits. You have grace, you bitch? It hurts. Thank you, Korga. Master Holson. Halson isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. This girl does like to talk, doesn't he? Oh, Shadowheart does as well. I know that look. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least, in case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. 
I'm not touching it. I've got to see what this is about. Get the hell in there. It's like it's damaged or something. Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Positive. You can trust me on that. That's good to hear. Fine. What's on your mind? You're not the kind of... And I haven't forgotten that you saved my... Let's see what you're saying. That woman has more venom in her heart than a snake in its fangs. But at least the child is safe. What is youth if not a time to be forgiven for one's transgressions? Exactly. Couldn't agree more. The girl wasn't innocent. But that doesn't mean she was guilty. Exactly. That's actually a good way of putting it. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? Monster? Too kind. A demon, more like. Ooh. Yes, you would say so. I know your kind. You see only villains and victims. A viper bears her fangs, defending her brood. I call her mother. You call her monster. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. And mine perish if he stays. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Sevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. I'm not so sure about that. Some men seem wrong about that. Oh, um, <clears throat> something as well, Kira. Have you noticed the the weapon? I managed to get the weapon in the fight. I see you. Oh, just bl give me a moment. It's little blue jay. A moment. This medicatrix. There. Aww. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? You found her, but I still don't know what she can do for you. Why are you asking? A tadpole. A mind flare tadpole. I. Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. Fingers crossed. We need uh, to be quick. This way. Even though I know this won't work. Cool. in that 
vessel. Take a closer look. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Hmm. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Uh, I said something. <laughs> Rather too common as of late. At least that's what Master Halson suspected. I pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things, studied them. Still, we have options. You don't have to be here for this. I'd like to stay, if it's all the same. All right. Let's see what we can do. She shifts uneasily. Hesitating. Something's off. Yeah. It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? <laughs> Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, What's that sound? You've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. If I it... hope it doesn't <clears throat> come to that, but thank you. Shut up, Bruce. Here. Um. You know, I've spent my life treating foe and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking, studying, trying to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Mind flayers reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms and a new mind flayer is born. The thing in your skull, though, it's different to anything in our records. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections, and it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Weird. And why am I saying this? I know how this goes. Could be. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. I think so. I hope so. I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? That makes sense. Thank you. It would mean everything to the groom. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. 
Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. One step at a time, Nettie. Come on. Why the... Never tried it, and I hope to keep it that way. Better a quick draft than ceramorphosis, nonetheless. Better than becoming a mind flayer. Keep it, in case things start to go very wrong. Kira, is this like, does this have a mind flyer in it? And if so, this is the sort of thing you usually like to eat. What's that? What was the perception check for? I don't know. Let's get moving. I actually want to hit something. Yeah, <laughs> pardon me. Hmm. Question. Oh, I kind of need to talk to this guy, though. You ever scare me like that again, and I'll feed you to a knoll. Mom, I'm fine. Stop it. Our little hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we'd do without her. Likewise. Arabella? Thank you. For helping me. What's that? Well, that's inspired. It's my job too. The druids don't care about us. No one does. Oh, it's a thing. That girl. I don't care what the mole says. Stupid and reckless. Let's get to move on them. <laughs> Something's going on over there, looks like. We're exposed now. Hmm. Stone door that leads somewhere. Who are you? I heard what happened. Thank you for protecting the child. Are if you? the druids are this far gone, then it's not just goblins we have to fear. So we can risk violence here, or face it for certain on the road. Quite the choice, isn't it? It's good of you to offer, but there's a whole army of goblins out there. We'd need an army of our own to escort us safely to Baldur's Gate. And while I don't doubt your abilities, you're no army. He's got a point. There may be a way, though. Goblins are ill-disciplined. It's unlike them to organize so cleverly. Somebody must be leading them, bringing discipline to their ranks. Take out that leadership, and they'll scatter. The Blade of Frontiers has done what he can to help us prepare for the journey, 
And we are grateful. But it'll be a short journey if the goblins still own the roads. By the Triad, there is only one correct answer. Refuse him, and we sentence these people to die. Everyone in this camp depends on it. Thank you. Let we'll it be ready shall to be leave done. as soon as you give word. No, sir. But if there's a clear path past those goblins, they'll find it. Yes. Of course. So, um, what did what did you and Ben do while he was in Ireland? If you're still there, Kira. Don't make me urge you, boy. Too late! Looking at you is painful get... enough. I still need to talk to this guy. We should be getting drunk at least. I don't know what to do with him. Get back, kid. I don't have it! How stupid are you? I'm only gonna ask you one more time, boy. Hand over my locket. I don't have your ugly locket. I never seen it before. How'd you know it's ugly? Hand it over or I'll slap the teeth out of your head. Just you don't understand. The kid stole my locket. He go oh, the hell's with this. These little devils get away with everything because of cuddly bastards like you. Did I get off up and knock it either? Someday. I hope I get to see it. Maybe you will, but personally, I doubt it. See you around. <laughs> All right, let's get going. Looks like we have to take the, the long way around. Weird. Time to talk. All right, all right. I, was just, I was just trying to help you. Calm down. Oh, bloody hell. One heck of an itch. Oh. I know there hasn't been much combat here, guys, but I have to admit. <laughs> There's a lot of story I've got to go through here. Thank you. All right. It's the time I tussled with hill giants without breaking a sweat. Now, a mere werebear could. I've known a few warlocks in my time. Talented, of course. Um, Kira. Are you there? I'm 
really wondered what people will say, Will, when they find out the monster hunter is becoming a monster. I've faced countless perils and conquered them all. This will be no different. I've always had a soft spot for the confident ones. They always disappoint, though. Jeez, what is her problem? Oh, funny. How can I help? Dead goblins, dead travelers. There's been a fire to the Druid's Grove. As students of the arcane arts, wizards can learn new spells by studying certain spell scrolls instead of using them. You're an impressive fighter game. Jeez. You should consider a new name. I'll take it you have some suggestions. The Wizard Wonder. Or how about the Master of the Wheel? Tempting. I think we might Something's waiting up ahead. Number of theatrical titles. There we go. Get over there! Surround them like! You spoiled us! Good! It's like they say. No fun in skewing a pig what doesn't know he's cooked. We got you surrounded. Oh, yeah, yeah. Here's how this goes. You take one step further, and we'll fill your front with arrows. Or you turn around, and your backside gets the same treatment. A strange symbol glows marked on their flesh, and something within you stirs in response. Clean. Hey, I got a hundred experience in that conversation. Next bearing mountain of fur, she was. Gave me a nasty scar. I hope you don't mind if I don't ask to see it. It looks like I have uh, something to do with that. <laughs> Does this lead again? <laughs> I don't know. A trap. This place is more dangerous than I thought. Let's disarm the trap then. I'm on a roll there, lads. Immune to slashing damage, right? <laughs> Let's try something else then. Okay. 
Eventually I'll figure this out. Alright, I'll switch to Pippin Gale with his Eldritch Blast. Ready and Why is this thing not weak to? There we go. Let's do a short rest. Awake and alert. Let's move. Where is this? Not disturb these webs. Whatever wove them would be much too large for my liking. It's the spider. It's a spider bit. I'll come back later for this. Right tool will do the trick. Let's do this. I want the goodies. Thank you. Eventually, I'll figure this out. With a why. Why? <laughs> why? That's right. But why? Why, why? A great uncle to name, my father said. But I just figured he couldn't spell. I see this fight. Look <laughs> what we got here. Another little birdie wanting to fly. Stop this thing! <laughs> Flap those wings some more, and I'll feed you a worm. And you. Hope you got a stomach for rights. What's it bloody look like? We're teaching this here pipsqueak to fly. Whoa. You want this little cave lurking what's it? Find your own. He's ours! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Of our time. Ooh, paladin advantage. The goblin's nostrils flare as if trying to judge you through smell alone. We're leaving. What about the gnome? Ain't we supposed to bring him to. I said we're leaving! Yeah, that's what There's I thought. plenty of sport and rich pickings out there for us. Move it! Fresh mates. Scared mates. Yes. Behaving barely. Uh. 
Alright, alright, keep your boldness on. Shut it. I better do a quick save just in case. I keep forgetting it's quick save. Shadowheart's attention is fixed on a damaged old statue. Shadowheart? Go on. We... we should keep moving. Nothing. The trick of the light. I'll take you as I find you. Now let the matter rest. Let's just move along. Time's a rare currency for both of us. How do I stop it again? Go, Jesus. Oh, this thing. That's what the brakes on the wheel. There we go. All done. I save day. <laughs> um, I'm sure you'll be fine. Yeah, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Oh my god, I just killed the gnome. Oh my god, that was hilarious. Uh, he's sleepy. I'll 
leave him to it. Um. Ah. I guess this way. Just as a makeshift sensor, if we need it. Leave it. Whoever's inside doesn't want an audience, and I don't want to fight. Yeah, mine. <laughs> Saving. Whoa, mysterious guy. My, my, what manner of place is this? A path to redemption? Or a road to damnation. Hard to say, for your journey is just beginning. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps. The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormier, don't they? Um... Well met, I am Raphael. Very much at your service. Neither. The fox, rather. Hiding, in a word. A silent observer about to break the silence. Of course, what I have to say merits some privacy, as well as some more, let's call it, refinement. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere for my tastes. Come. This is the sort of person that Will needs to uh, Will is there, tasked to kill, right? Somewhere. The house of hope, where the tired come to rest, and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be your last. <laughs> Are you not entertained? Well, far be it from me to disappoint. Demon. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. 
an adversary, conceivably, but a savior, that's for certain. Come now, why play hard to get when you're in deep over your tadpoled head? One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. <laughs> Everything is for sale. And you do well to sell while your stock has value. In desperate times, the price of honor plummets. Perhaps you haven't yet realized how desperate these times are. You will. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, that's when you'll come knocking on my door. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. <laughs> I've always wondered what a laughing mind flare sounds like. Okay, All now. those <clears throat> pretty little symptoms. Sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say, you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. Yeah, I'm not impressed. Let's actually punch something. It feels so easy to get lost here. The entrance to the goblin camp, I think. Goblins ahead. We'll need a cover story. A cover story. Ow. Is this going to be a recurring thing? Hmm. 
Let's uh, do a quick save. Actually, let's do a long rest. <sighs> let's end the day. Talk over here. Oh, him. We meet again as predicted. I shall be here in thy camp for whenever thou hast need of my services. A mending of the threat, should thou or any of thy compatriots perish. I will cleave soul to body once more. Okay, um... <clears throat> Bloody hells! Literally, just when I think I've got a grasp on our dilemma, a devil shows up. I know, right? No matter. We've dealt with every other oddity thrown at us lately. We can handle this one, too. Now, as for this Raphael, he knows our secret. He claims he can help. What do you make of him? No doubts at all. He seemed powerful and very knowledgeable about our problem. Not the worst prospect we've stumbled across. As long as you can look past what he is. Ah, yeah, Bradley. Everything good. Uh, yeah, this is a bit of a one-off, this. Me playing Baldur's Gate. <laughs> yeah. mm. Budge. <clears throat> yeah, I'm trying to be. I've made you doubt yourself. Sorry. Not what I intended. Let's take time to think about it. Some food and rest. Things will be clear then. We are planning to do this as a proper mm. playthrough with four people and when the crossplay update Sorry, comes in. I'm not so sure. Isn't it terrible when someone causes you to doubt yourself? Perhaps you're right. Perhaps a devil has our best interests at heart and wants nothing in return. We could throw ourselves at his feet, be they cloven or otherwise. Or perhaps we shouldn't. Clearly. And you know, I know people who work much like our new acquaintance does. You don't need a scourge or a rack to break people. Fear and self-doubt is sufficient. There were no right answers with that devil. He was hmm. toying with his food. Us. Perhaps you didn't. See? Sowing doubt is an old trick. Watch out for it. And for Raphael. I don't know what you mean. It's nothing, really. Shadow Heart. Oh, good lord, 18. I have to roll an 18. Looks like I'm using my inspirations. Yeah, 
There we go. Oof. Close one. You're not going to let this go, are you? You might wish you had. I worship Shah, the mistress of the night. It is my holy mission to oppose Saluna, her teachings and her followers. <laughs> it hurts. Now that you have the truth, please don't make a big fuss about it. I'm not, I'm not. Secrecy is everything for Shah's children. It is our code, our creed, our shield. I even keep secrets from myself. I had my memories suppressed, so that nothing I know could be used against the Dark Lady. Once I prove myself, my memories will be restored. Ah, uh, that's a bit... I'm not sorry I kept this from you. Not one bit. Though, perhaps that might change. If you can show an open mind. Don't thank me. I'm breaking Lady Shah's teachings just by doing so. But sometimes you have to be practical. The wound on my hand. It never quite heals. And sometimes it causes terrible pain to rip through me. It's my burden, though, from Lady Shah. I can feel her influence somehow. Nah, like I said, this is mainly like a trial thing to see how Baldur's Gate does. We'll be doing our regular stuff on um, Friday. No, no, not Friday. Sa Saturday. Thing is, uh, I kind of made a realization. I forgot to add Chin Chow to the list. I don't think so, but Shout you're sweet to ask. Maybe just be patient the next time you see me wince or cry out. It'll pass quickly enough. It always does. Pain is sacred to followers of Lady Shah. Pain will give way to loss and then to the peace of her eternal darkness. You can tolerate a great deal of suffering so yeah. long as it has meaning. And you know what's convenient as well? It actually rolled on Chincho after I added it to the list. Difficult to say. I'd like to hope there's more to it than that. Some meaning that Lady Shah will reveal to me when the time is right. I cannot say. Not with what I can recall. But even then, it would not be for me to question her will. I'll try my best. So, yeah, we'll be looking for Chen Shao on, on Saturday. Lady Shah considers it greater protection than any shield or armor. Alright, let's leave uh, Shadow Heart alone for a bit. And then in the morning we can actually do some actual fighting. Cheese. You don't sleep well, flitting no. between dreams and nightmares. Oh, you're here maybe when you wake up because you know something is wrong, or maybe you just get lucky. Uh, excuse me. Shit. Yes, shit. No, no, it's not what it looks like. I swear. I, I wasn't going to hurt you. I, I just needed, well, blood. Oh, that's nice. There, in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. 
a vampire, a slave to sanguine hunger. I've never killed anyone. Well, not for food. I feed on animals, boars, deer, kobolds, whatever I can get. But it's not enough. Not if I have to fight. I feel so... weak. If I just had a little blood, Dusty I could teeth. think clearer. Fight better. Please. I got dusty teeth. What do you mean? A strange sensation courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. <laughs> At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. No. I needed you to trust me. And you can trust me. Mainly because I need think allies. You could trust me just disgust a little further. I only need a taste. Are you, are you trying to spell I disgusting? Swear. Really? I ah. Of course. Well, to be fair, I am a drag. Uh, well, a, a Astarian Let's is a make vampire. Let's comfortable, shall we? I gotta make sure I get the sensor ready. It's like a shard of ice into your neck, a quick, sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches. Your pulse quickens. Alright, you've all right, you've had your sip. You've had your sip, calm down. Hmm? Oh, of course. That that was amazing. My mind is finally clear. I feel strong. I feel happy. Shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. Now, if you'll excuse me, you're invigorating, but I need something more filling. This is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. He watches his stalks towards the forest, stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. Ah. Uh -huh. Just to be clear, I'm not going to be romancing um, a starion in this run. <clears throat> um. What does Bloodless do? Feels a bit woozy. Minus one attack roll save. Oh god. Good morning. How do you feel? It'll pass. Just be glad I'm not a true vampire. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn. Like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their powers. Oh, I've no idea. Hmm. For 200 years, the sun would have turned me to cinders. Until the crash, when I woke up bathed in its light. That's interesting. Someone, or something, wants me alive. They've changed the rules. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. All right, calm down.
That's my theory. But who knows? I'm just glad. Although there's still time. So we're traveling with a vampire, are we? Of course we are. Word of warning, Astarian. I taste absolutely awful. <laughs> Fine. As long as he keeps his fangs off our necks. Oh, quite the opposite. Well, I'm disapproves. Of openness and honesty to work together as a team. You say all the right words, but I'm not so sure you mean the right things. Still, I will respect the decision that was made. There now. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. Even though he won't even be on the team. Is there actually a way to get rid of the, the bloodless? I don't know. I'm not saying many people would. Right. Let's quick save and then we'll start this. Look it, Claw. Sapper's here. Unless you've got another reason to be here. Feck sight. Let's try to be diplomatic, shall we? Goblins don't come by the handfuls, but by the dozens. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. To roll 15. Alright, good enough. There we go. Down, Claw, back up! Don't kick her. She's a little overexcited. It's been a busy day. Let's celebrate him. Who? If he ain't one of us, and if he's here, he's down in the pits. Down in the pits? Either Halston's in a foul mood, or he awaits a gallant rescue. Likely both. Heh! <laughs> Depends who you are. We're celebrating a raid! No better time in camp than this. Get yourself a bit of fun before it dries up. Rip the guts out of Joaquin's rest we did. Inns are good for gutting. Lads even captured some Duke. Worth celebrating, that is. Hmm. I guess I did good then if I got experience. Oh yes, I remember this bit. Hear my voice. Obey my command. The voice is irresistible. You recognize the overwhelming authority that you've used on others, only infinitely stronger, and turned against you. Your vision clouds, leaving you in a dark, featureless shadowscape. Nothingness in every direction. Then there are three figures before you. An armored male elf exuding power and command. A handsome younger man with a quick, easy smile. And a pale young woman with even paler eyes. These are my chosen. They speak for me. Aid their search for the prison, and you will be worthy to stand beside them in my presence. Weird.
What is that? You feel energy pulsing from the artifact, lifting the pain from you, pushing the voice away. My power grows. My forces gather. The reckoning draws here. Don't give me that look. I don't know what just happened any more than you do. We should keep going. Isn't that something? The artifacts scattered the voice to the four winds. Trust me, I will. Let's keep going. through you. Authority. Two. Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. Oh, big pardon. You must be here to join the other true souls. Uh, please! Go right ahead. Well, like Priestess, the Absolute is... Saluna. As if mingling with a horde of goblins wasn't bad enough. Let's do what we have to do, then get out of here. Quite the understatement, but yes. Let's not let a visit in return. That'll be some real fun. <laughs> his good eye. You think you can hurt me? Let's rip him apart! Let's do this fine, let's finish this off. <laughs> Considering it took this long to actually get into a fight, I'm appreciative of this. Damn it. Never a dull moment. Best be on my way. Oh, the cat's gone. Hmm. 
Uh, let's try this guy. Why do I have a disadvantage though? Let's throw something at Shadowheart. How can you miss a health potion? I don't know what to do with him. I need to obviously save my character in a way. But I can't move Shadow Heart. I don't know much about this game, do I? to get Will and my character now. Not just them now. Of 
I should do that. How many times are you going to do that? I think that just sums up how this was gonna go. <laughs> All right, we'll leave we'll leave things here, I guess. Um, again, like we are planning to do this in the future with a, a proper competent group, so maybe that might be more entertaining then. But until then, uh, that'll be it for now. When it comes to Baldur's Gate, uh, next stream will be on Friday for more Sea of Thieves, hopefully. If not, more Dynamax Adventures. And yeah, until then, um, I hope you have a good day. And if you like the VOD, please consider liking and subscribing. And I'll see you there.